DSP Trigger has a very powerful rim shot detection system that allows you to easily trigger rim shots even at very low velocities. Good rim shot detection starts with a good calibration, so make sure when you're calibrating you hit the head and the rim portions of the pad hard so that DSP Trigger knows just how hot your signal is. By right clicking on the rim shot display area, you'll find the rim shot range control which you can use to fine tune the rim shot detection. Before we start adjusting it, let's have a look at the red indicator in the control and see how it moves when we hit the pad. When we hit the head of the pad, it falls to the left side of the control. When we hit the rim portion of the pad, it falls to the right. You can probably guess what happens when we try a rim shot. Ideally, we want the head hits and the side sticks to fall an equal distance away from the center of the control. If you find they are lopsided, you can use the gain scaler of the right channel to balance them. Have a look at what happens when I turn up the gain a little bit. Now the hits and the side sticks are lopsided towards the side stick area and we start getting missed triggers when we hit the head of the pad. Adjust the gain until they are nicely balanced. Remember that a little goes a long way, and if it needs any adjustment after calibration, chances are you only need to move it a tiny little bit. The rim shot range control allows you to set the size of the rim shot sweet spot. Once the hits and the side sticks are nicely balanced, we want to make it as large as possible without getting missed triggers. When properly adjusted, you should have little trouble triggering rim shots at just about any velocity.